first I dealt with Austin, and now I'm here? The hell is this... The hell is this place? And how am I since I got huge energy? <sighs> Might as well start exploring the place. <sighs> kind of looks like... Kind of looks like Mobius, but... I don't really get the whole... Place. Who's that over there? Shadow? Wait. No. You're not Shadow. Who are you? Well, I am Shadow. But I prefer to go by Rifle instead. Rifle, huh? By the way, where am I? Welcome to my world. You're in a place known as Lovely Farm. A world that's still on the dead or alive. Yeah, kind of took a rough landing over here. Must, must have been somebody to bring you. Somebody. <sighs> I'm guessing you're the reason? No. Then who is? There has to be something. I didn't come here on my own. Well, maybe somebody else does. It wasn't me. I don't know who you are, and you're not even a purpose to what I'm trying to achieve. No, you don't know who I am. I'm Blade. I'm Blade the Hedgehog. I'm a demon. I'm a demon hunter and a dragon prince from Hellboy. And I caught your name was right. Yeah. Hmm. I preferred me. See. Um. Wait. What's that star next? That's just my father. Uh, well, what's left over of him after our fusion? What's his name? His name is Glenn. Oh. But, I guess in some of your time, you would refer to him as Doom. You mean Doom, the leader of the Black Arms? I suppose you Thought you were against me. <laughs> I'm what sorry. Damn it, disappointing time. Sorry, I just didn't really notice time Wait a minute, none of that heard about you. You were in the dragon, have you? <laughs> he's a he's a hedgehog like me. Well, Back in the VR chat, he was in a, a Sonic album. I don't know. And yes, and awesome. the other day, he was in a, uh, a Dante album. If I did, I don't remember, nor did I care. Well, so that's how I heard about you. He told me about you. <laughs> I'll see you as a threat, yes. So anyway... You said this is your world. Yeah. Perhaps. Kind of disappointing. It won't be eventually. You're kind of disappointing to me, actually. Well. Uh, yes, it won't be that. If, if I'm a disappointment, then you won't be in my way. Do I have a reason to be in your way? That's not for you to know. Yeah. I have- I beg you for You don't I, come from the timeline, so it doesn't matter. I travel across the multiverse. This is the first time I've been here. But I can tell by your luck, you're already up to no good. Hmm. That's none of your importance. Is now. You don't like it? Get through me. I don't need. Hold on. What? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. This again? What? <sighs> Just would you rather crap again? No. Oh. Wait. You don't know what this is? 
Jackpot. Hey, demon, I'm talking to you. Nope, nor do I care. Well, I said, do you want to try? Don't care. Games is for children. It's, apparently, don't have a choice. It's but for it's for anyone. My brother isn't here, and I can't find him. Your brother? Wait, you're talking about Eclipse, are you? I'm me. Might as, we might as well keep, play this game. Um, are you interested? Fine. All right. Let well, kill some time. Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. This is Blade the Hedgehog, and welcome back to Would You Rather. Now, to be honest, I actually thought I was done with this thing after the events with Austin, but surprisingly, I am in a different world, and I'm not alone. As always, I have um. Rifle, was it? Yeah. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Yes. I already have, but I guess I should introduce myself a bit more. Sure. I am Calamity Chef, also known as Rifle. Hmm. Why I'm here is none of the reporters. Anyway. I get that a lot. Since I'm here, I'll go ahead and read the first one. Would you rather eat a worm straight from the ground, or snatch a fly out of the air and eat it alive? I'd rather eat a worm that is. Yeah, sure. Sure. Yeah, we both lost a life. Apparently, humans are stupid. Flowers can actually contain a bunch of E. coli, depending on where they are in the area they've been in. Yeah, nor do I care. So, what about... So, you said something about Calamity Shadow? I'm assuming you're a different version. Yes. Well, the next question is for you, so here you go. Would you rather be a leaper? Leopard or be a midget. Okay, no idea what the hell a leopard is. But I know what a midget is. I know what a leopard is. Would you mind I'd rather be a midget. It's a type of disease. Or you're slowly decaying despite being alive. Huh, yeah, be a midget. Alright. Would you rather be stuck on the moon or be stuck at the bottom of the ocean? I've been on the moon before. And I'm guessing it doesn't bug me. And I'm guessing you'll stay stuck in the moon. I I can't hear you, Michael. I wasn't speaking. So I'll take it as a yes. Yes. <sighs> That's something. I've been stuck in the moon. So, since you're a different shadow, what's exactly your age? Sorry for asking. I'm about 98 years old. So, 40 years older than the shadow we know? Crap, yes. I see. I mean, my brother's only 10 years younger than I am. 84? Yep. Seems like a good, seems like a good, um, whatever it is, Darkling, I think. But, um... Hey, oh. I'll start. Oh, I just realized we're in the next question, so, here. Would you rather have a nail hammer through your every joint inch of your finger? Or have a famous starry night only carved into your back with night? I mean, you love this question, do <laughs> I... I'd rather have... 
the fifth famous sorry night slowly caught the back. My back Either one doesn't matter to me. Just pick one. Fine. I'll pick the red one. There we go, we both won. Alright. For the rest of your life, would you rather eat every meal with carbonara sauce or drink every drink mix with four loco? I'd rather have every drink I drink mixed with four loco. What is four loco? I've never even heard of that. I believe it's some type of alcohol, but I could be wrong. I'd rather Oh, this is your question. And I don't have this one. Hmm. That's fine. Humans are so suckers for the poison of the brain. Well, uh, for your information, I am not actually it's immortal. Not. Well, aren't we in the same boat? Because I'm not an alcoholic. I just rather drink alcohol, because I can't eat. Well, my roommate's birthday passed, so... Hmm. Would be incorrect to say that I can eat something when I can't. I don't exactly have a stomach. I can tell. Anyway, here's your question. Would you rather live in your dream house, thousands of miles from any civilization, or live in the city of your dreams in a small voice with five foreigners you can't understand? Okay, I'd rather live in a dream house, thousands of miles. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Anyway, live in the city of your dreams in a small house. <laughs> I'd rather live in my dream house, thousands of miles from any civilization. Therefore, nobody can bug me when I want to do my plans. You now. And uh, damn it! <laughs> Would you rather be waterboarded to death or be electrocuted to death? Electrocuted to death. What do you do here? Well, depends who you ask. Depends on who you ask, actually. I'm at... We're all doing different things here. I'm talking to you. Hmm. Well, I just simply work with the doctor. Sometimes this is my father. And I've been working on my own. Well, I don't have the plans to help another person find their own type of soul. Well, you could continue your answer after this question. Would you rather never shave ever again, or never cut fingers? No, I don't shave, so I'd rather just never shave. Our species doesn't need to change. Good point. Would you rather be wanted for murder and be on the run, or be a homeless man who only has boxes? Okay, I, I really don't want this. Oh, I just pick murder. Uh, cool. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it's already what I'm dealing with anyway. So, There's no change in life. So, back to your answer. Oh, is that? Not. I'm just helping a certain somebody get souls after they got perished by some civilization. G what? G U N. They tend to have caused me a lot of problems myself, huh. and everyone else around you seems to be better. You're the most more messed up than I Really feel bad. Well, 
I guess you could say. It won't be missed after a while. Just, just read your question. Would you rather be loved or feared? <sighs> huh. Well, this is kind of a tough one, actually. Because there are some leaders out there that want to be respected, but there are some leaders that want to be afraid of themselves. Um, well, I'd rather be loved. Love is a chemical that is only us for so long. Yeah. Eventually, it will go away in your brain for a while. Yeah, that's what she said. We're going with love. So I'm guessing you did you went with feared or you went with love. Hmm. I'd rather be feared. Well you lost. Well, you lost. Not that it matters. It doesn't matter too much. Would you rather live in a penthouse in the city or live in a mansion in the country? I'd rather live in a mansion in the country. Huh. Well, I... I'd rather... Yeah, sure. I guess. Alright, we both got it. So, what exactly happened? Well... Back to our conversation. It used to be a peaceful place, until Gleam and Dark on it. Oh, what? Gleam and Dark on the Lord of the Dark and the Lord of the Light. They both eventually perished, but... Well... Didn't exactly leave this place in a very... Happy era. Does he have a name? This world? No, you're... The thing you're talking about. What thing? And just tell me the name of the world, I guess. Well, the planet I'm in is called Eternium. The timeline I'm in is known as Mobifall. Ah, Mobifall. No wonder it's so bad. I need to find a way out of here at least. Don't worry. Eventually you'll never have to see this place again. Or any place connected to it. Is that a threat? No. Yeah, it's a promise. Yeah, it's better. Anyway, read your question. It's a promise, but not connected to you. Just read your question. Would you rather speak everything in the surround south, or have your own entrance theme when you walk in a room? I'd rather have my own entrance theme. Yeah, I can agree. Alright, so would you rather forget who you were, or forget ev who you, everyone you know is? I'd rather forget who I am. Do I have to ask is that, why, or is it completely obvious? If I forgot who I was, I wouldn't have the memories of everything that happened to me. Hmm. I'd rather but at the you. same time, I'd be able to be in the back. I have quite the name of this. It would be easy to read my memory and make it better. Give myself a better understanding. I'd rather forget who I am. Yep. Got it. So, what do you mean by a promise, anyway? Well, it's not a threat towards you. But, this world is a danger to everyone else. Eventually, when this world dies, which it will eventually, they will move. And, all, and for all we know, they could do the same thing they did to Maria. So you had a Maria too. Guess that's maybe guess that's not the case. <laughs> anyway, moving on. Own a mini horse or own a regular? I'd rather own a regular. A mini horse is useful. Yeah, I do can't even ride. Rest of your life, would you rather live in a library? Books are your only form of entertainment. Or live in a TV or, 
or live in a prison cell where you have access to any channel and key. Well, books can give you a lot of information. More information than TV can. Usually TV just leads you to information that is incorrect. Books normally tell the truth. Humans are usually led to believe lies through television is very, very stupid out Yeah. So, would you rather be in a library, I, I assume? I'd rather be in a library. I can get more information the better than you'd rather. I can. And we won. About time you're about time I have competition in this. It's less of a competition, more of a <laughs> way of thinking of knowledge. Knowing whether or not the other one is intelligent or not. Alright, here you go, this is your question. Would you rather live in a penthouse in LA? LA? We live in a townhouse in London. I did say it. Oh, well, I didn't hear you. Anyway, I'd rather live in a penthouse in LA. I'm not really into the fancy stuff. Hmm. What would you do? I'd rather live in a penthouse in LA. Yep, got it. Would you rather live in a penthouse places are oh, too hard to me. Oh, I, I'm sorry. Rather spend a day with Michael Phelps or spend a day with Ryan Locke. I don't know who either are, so I'll just go with Ryan. Which one? I don't know who either are, so I'm just gonna go with Ryan. I guess I'll go with you. Oh, you lost this one. Yeah, this one could work. So, um, do you have any questions for me, actually? Yeah. Why are you so interested? Interested in what? Interested in here. I was never interested in here. While I'm here, I'm finding a way out. Well, you seem to be asking quite a lot of questions. I'm learning more about the dimension. But why are you so interested? Shut the hell up. Would you rather be stuck in a room with dead bodies and breathe by a flight? Yeah, I would. I deal with dead bodies all the time. I'd rather be Because I know that. Rather only eat breakfast cereal or only eat pasta? I'd like cereal. I'll give you. And I got this one. Be quiet, rifle. Some on your mind. Just think. Planning out how things are going to go. Also communicating with my father at the same time. You can't exactly plan something tiring and not be quiet. Sometimes you have to listen to your own thing. Think of the flaws with the plans. So I'm guessing you're. So I guess you know what I'm already thinking, right? Hmm. Perhaps. Perhaps not. Well, if I say my answer, you'll change your... If I, if I say my answer, you'll change what you're going to do. Got it. Anyway, your question. Would you rather eat a tablespoon of salt, or eat a tablespoon of cinnamon? I'd rather have cinnamon. I'd rather have salt. 
And just like that, you lost. I come I made another comeback. Hmm. Now that's not <sighs> Alright, now that that's out the way. How do I get out of here? Well same way you got in. I wasn't brought here by Will. And I didn't bring you. You better tell me who it is. How can I tell you who it is when I don't even know myself? Jeez, you're an idiot. Am I an idiot? Yeah. It's common sense, actually. If I don't know who someone is, how am I supposed to tell you the answer? It would be idiotic to assume, instead of giving you an answer when I know. What are you planning? You said you have plans. What are they? Plans for this time, and not your own. If it includes your timeline, well, you'll know. Yeah. You may, but for now, you may have gave me a I gave you a promise. I'm giving you about my own. I'm giving you a promise, punk. Just try and threaten our world. You deal with me. Got it. No, oh, please. The only time your world will be a threat is if you think it's connected to mine. Well, and. <laughs> yeah, not like you had a good life anyway. I'm out of here. Ah, before you go. Tell my brother I said hi, and tell him if he doesn't come back soon, the world he's protecting is soon going to be in danger itself. His lies aren't going to work forever, but they will know. Oh, you, oh, you think, oh, you are an answer, are you? Oh, no, no. Like I said, go after my world, and you get it. I don't care how powerful you can be. Is just that know, so? just know, every demon has a weakness. <laughs> oh Let's yeah. Let's see you trying to find the weakness in this. Oh yeah. Say hi to Gene you went for. Like you're gonna see him anyway. <laughs> well. If you really want to know so badly how powerful I am. Huh? Say hi to this thing. What the? Hmm. 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 Yeah. What the hell was that? Whew. At least I'm out of there. Guess Rifle is right. He is a tough being. But he's after Eclipse. Yo, you fool! I got I got a water bath. That energy. <sighs> well, gotta get moving. <clears throat> Hope you guys saw what you saw. Farewell. Stay safe. <clears throat>